like, comment, and subscribe because if you're just watching and you're not subscribed, what are you doing? Today, I'm just going to be, you know, chit-chatting it up with you guys, giving you guys a life update, um, and just talking a little bit more about what I've been doing, where I've been at, and etc. Now I am in the car. I'm about to go to school so that I can hand in some documents that I need to bring to the financial aid office um so i recently i started my internship for school you guys know my, well some of you guys know that my major for school is social work in which i'm almost done with um so yeah with the social work program with any program you have to do an internship um because it's required i think it's 480 hours yeah so that's what I've been doing. My internship is at a nursing home um, in Queens, New York. And it's been going pretty good. Um, it's been going pretty good. When I first, like, okay, so when I first, initially, I never wanted to work. Like, the person who, like, plans everything like that, they basically do a meeting with you and you tell them, like, your interests and things like you wouldn't, like, a place you wouldn't want to work at as far as like your internship and like your daily I mean your later on career or life or whatever and my main thing was I didn't want to work in a nursing home and I didn't want to work doing like drug abuse or anything like that um let me turn this car off so yeah Somehow, I ended up getting placed in a nursing home anyways after I expressed that I didn't want to do the nursing home. So, in the beginning, I was really, like, annoyed about it. Like, I wasn't excited about starting an internship or none of that because it's just something that I didn't want to do. It's not. So, like, my first day, I wasn't really, like, excited or anything, but I was, like, anxious to kind of see, like, what I would be doing. And I was anxious to see, like, just how a daily life would go. A daily day would go, like, working in the nursing home um, as a social worker, as a social work intern. So, it wasn't bad. Um, I was really nervous at first, like, with me. So, like, I'm a nervous person. Like, I'm really shy. I'm not going. Um, once I get used to you or you feel like my friend, then I feel like I'm a little, like, you know, I'm more loosened up. But when it's like when i'm put in a situation where i'm not comfortable with it i've never done it before and then especially if it's something i didn't want to do in the beginning that is where like the uncomfortable feeling comes in so at first i was really 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 uncomfortable um and i just wasn't used to that type of setting like i've worked at a bunch of jobs in my life but i never worked as i never worked working i never worked with older people elderly people or anything around those lines like i know like i've been around my grandparents and stuff that were old and seen like you know the type of care they needed and you know hospital visitations even like before my grandfather just passed a couple months ago i used to visit him in the nursing home for years so i know like the feeling of going to a nursing home and seeing a loved one but i never really like i don't really know too much about it um, so yeah, I would say like now, I'm definitely way more comfortable with everything, um, seeing how, I'm in, so I'm in like an office, it's me, and there's three other social workers, one of them is a bachelor's social worker, and the other two are master's social workers, so MSWs, um, they're really nice and sweet. And I definitely make sure that I'm getting something out of. Um, I don't know what happened, but <clears throat> I think I left off at like about the social workers. So yeah, they definitely make sure that I'm getting something out of each day, which is great because you know it's a learning experience, the internship. So you're supposed to go there and learn things. Um, so I'm glad that I have. I'm glad that even though it's somewhere I didn't want to be, I'm glad that I'm somewhere where they make me do things, they make me learn different things, and I'm just learning, I'm growing, so that's the good thing about it. So, so far I've been doing like a couple things on my own, I've been doing BIM, BIM is kind of like a, just a little memory test for them, so 
sometimes sometimes some people can't talk at all so sometimes you're not able to do the bims but a bims goes something like okay so i'm gonna give you i'm gonna just do a little a little thing how i do so i'm like hi um my name is jazz i'm a social work intern and i'm just here to do a quick assessment with you and you know they'll say okay no problem or whatever and then i'll say okay so i have three words that i need you to repeat for me and i need you to remember oh i need you to memorize these words so the words are socks blue and bed and then they say socks blue and bed if they don't get it i say it again um or whatever so then i ask them what the year is do they know the year i ask them do they know what month we're in um do they know the day of the week um and sometimes they get confused because you know they're old so like at first i got i always got stuck on how to, i always got stuck on that part when i was doing it on my own in the beginning but now i'm a little bit more comfortable with it comfortable with it um knowing that i have to speak loud because sometimes they can't understand me and then you can also cue them so sometimes they get like the year mixed up with like the month so i'll say like you know what year is it and they'll say like it's february oh no like the year like you know what year like you know you have to keep repeating yourself so it's a little bit tricky because it takes a lot of patience you have to have patience and i don't have patience at all but for some reason when it comes to like working like in a work setting i do have a little bit more patience than i have in like my personal life with like family and friends and stuff so <clears throat> that's good so yeah i do that and then you kind of score them on like based off of how they did and then you go at the end do you remember the three words that i um said to you in the beginning and if they could say them then you write that down you know that if they don't remember the words then you don't know it sometimes they remember like one out one out of three other words that you said which is good too and that gives them like a point so i think so i think does it give them a point no i think they have the oh yeah it does give them a point okay so yeah so then you score them and that's like kept on like the database or whatever and the computers to see and then those are done like i don't know if they're not weekly but they're done often so, so like, like yeah i have a fun time doing those um even though sometimes like some people give me trouble like some people are really good they're nice they let you you know do what you gotta do but then some people are like very moody sometimes and they just don't want to communicate with you like or they never seen you before so they don't trust you like who are you i remember i got questioned one time like he didn't trust me and you know he had some he had some issues with um the social workers there at um at the nursing home so he kind of being you know that i said i'm a social work intern it's like okay you're a part of them so i have an issue with you too even though i don't know you so that was really tricky i had to like for somehow like make him trust me to just do the quick assessment with me and then he was venting to me and so it's kind of like okay like i'm coming here for this person you know because i can't wait to see this person so yeah like i feel like i like it in that sense um i love seeing the old people i love seeing like when you speak to them and they have a lot of personality i love when they you know they say how they love it here and like the staff is so nice like that's that's i like that I love that for them that even like even the predicament that they're in they're still happy um they're still enjoying themselves so yeah that's a that's a good that's that's how i feel about right now that's how i feel right now but yeah i can't wait to see um how far it takes me in the end and the things i'll be doing in the end on my own and etc because i've only been here for like ugh, maybe like four weeks five weeks i don't know i haven't been there long so like i'm still adjusting i'm still getting used to everyone i'm still you know but i'll get there um and what else was i gonna say to you guys but yeah yeah i'm that's what i was gonna say i'm over school like, i'm ready for school to be done i have two more semesters and it cannot come any freaking faster but yeah so that's what i'm about to do right now i'm about to go to i'm about to go to uh, my school so that i can hand in the documents that i need to hand in so that i can start getting paid for the internship my internship that i'm doing because right now i am not and yeah um i'll probably take you guys along with me with me why not and yeah i'm ready to go take this long drive to Staten island 
like it's no traffic right now so well it was no traffic before i decided to make a youtube video before i do it before i decided to do a little vloggy vlog but i don't know now but we're gonna see um but yeah um I'll, i'm gonna tune back to end with you guys um once i get there so So I filled out everything that I need to fill out. I just now need to wait to speak to them. Yeah. I'm just waiting for my class to start. My class still starting until 6.30. So, I'm just in the car, chilling. And it's pouring. It is pouring, y'all. I don't know how I feel about it. All I know is it better stop. Okay? Okay. Uh, I'm about to take a little mini nap before 6.30 because I'm mad tired. And this rain is just not making it any better. So that's what I'm about to do. I'm going to check back in with you guys. So I'm going to class now, y'all. It is like raining, so I'm trying to get there. I need an umbrella. I haven't had an umbrella in forever. <laughs> So I am headed back to the car and stuff. It's raining, so I don't, do not need this to get wet. Um, but yeah, today was cool, guys. This is like my most boring class, so I hate Mondays because the class. Oh, that's that too. So it's the rain, and then on top of like the class is just boring as hell. Don't be talking about nothing. The class is like social studies. That's what it seems like to me. Um, I used to hate social studies. Let me know if y'all like social studies as a teenager. I hated school, period. But social studies was never, I was never a fan of that. But yeah, that's pretty much it. I just wanted to chat with you guys a little bit and take y'all with me to school or whatever. Um, thank you guys for watching. If you are still watching this far, make sure you guys like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll get back with you guys on my next video.